Gary's in. Goodness, man. What's up, man? I gotta be doing, Gary. How's your guys' days going? Hope you guys are having good ones, man. You guys are having a good day, man. Pretty good. Makes some leftover pizza with air fryer front. Nice, dude. I love that day after. Really, everybody loves day after pizza. Day after pizza is nice. Hmm. Yeah, that'll keep you busy. I think that'll keep you very busy too, Gary. I'm trying to be more patient than I have been. I keep burning up my rear, so I'm trying to really feed it in this time. Oh yeah, some additional day, so it's gonna be a busy day, hopefully. Yeah. You're probably losing weight too, Gary, just from like working so damn much, just from running around collecting dishes and constantly moving your arms and stuff. Probably already noticing weight loss. Hello, Jet.
Making that money? Hell yeah, dude. I'm glad you're, you're getting more data than that. Too. Driving on me. Especially when you enjoy where you work, dude. Like, if you enjoy what you do, where you work, it, it feels pretty good. It feels accomplishing, right? It's when you're not, and for you, man, because you've been only busting tables for so long, man, this is all fresh and new, dude. You just got to keep trying to move positions, learn different things. Don't let yourself get stagnant. Don't let yourself get complacent or bored. Slow my throttle, mid throttle. As the graphics going good, I gotta start working on your logo here real soon. I've just been uh, working on Jenkins' logo. Jenkins asked me for a logo before you. You're next. I finally finished mechanics. I posted that in the Discord. So happy to finish that. I still need to arm myself, paint a new shop. Yeah, dude, it's gonna be interesting, man. I'm I'm excited for it. Oh, yeah. I am excited to be doing the graphics. We're working on the winner's template right now. I sent that over to Grant. I got that one and then a uh, a total winner's one that we're gonna we're gonna put together. It's gonna be fun. Yeah, and they they wanted somebody who could win bottom splits as like. You're still learning to race, so you're going to be still racing down there. And even winning races and stuff, dude, like... You're still learning, you know? You're going to be you're gonna be sub 3K for, for a little bit longer. So I was like, this is the guy that is going to be racing all those guys trying to get out of those splits. Like, this is the guy that you want. Yeah, we're trying to be diverse here. Like, I'm, I'm doing the graphics and stuff, but, like, it's nice that I can have input. Like, everybody's got input as part of that chat of what they, they want to build here. That's been pretty cool to see them all talk about it. I think I need to open up my wheel a little bit more there. Be right back, get lunch. All right, panic. I'll see you when you get back, baby. Stay old, drivers. I'm still finishing off my season with EPI. When, when EPI is, uh, when, when this season's done, man, I'll be sad to move on from that for a little bit. You know, if it's a permanent thing, then that'll be awesome. Really kind of cool. I like the opportunity. I'm trying to bring in people that I know would love an opportunity, too. Whether it's just to be fast, to be competitive, or just to be noticed, dude. Everybody deserves a chance.
Okay, that's pretty scary. Thank you, Gary. Thank you. He towed, he's gone, he towed. Next turn, Ethan, I'll give you the low side. Appreciate it. No trouble, go get him. You said it was? What's up, Fox? A tablet? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, da, 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 da. Was that the one I talked about on stream? I think I pulled it up on stream and talked about it last time. I'll double check on it, dude. Um, I got to look at the price on it because I was, I was looking at that compared to the XP and Wacom because I have a Wacom and an XP. Because it's not one of those, right? It's a full screen tablet. Turn, Dustin. Yeah, yeah, it's a full screen tablet. Like the, the whole screen is, is touched with a pen. You can actually look down and see what you're doing. Stream had to go to work. Okay, I'll look over it again, dude. I'll send you a written message Cars this time. I thought you were. I thought you were in stream. My bad. I'll send you a written response. And if you really want to, if you really want a full screen, dude, I'm trying to think if I'm ever actually going to use the one that I have, dude. I've got a Wacom that I'm not using. Like it's it's sitting under my desk right now, collecting dust. I, uh, I have a tablet, and that's why I was recommending the XP on stream, was because I have just a, a tablet with no screen. If you don't want to break the bank and see if you really enjoy it first, man, I would run with that. It's it's like less than 100 bucks, and it, uh, I mean, I enjoy the hell out of it. I think it's a ton of fun. The head man said, eject Osito, cuz! Oh. 
I'm going hard. No problem. You're welcome. Got Jared Harness. I, I want to see what I'm doing. Yeah, no, 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 I get you. It's a. Uh, the only reason, also, that's the other reason why I suggested. So you need another HDMI port, right, to use that tablet. So those tablets run off HDMI or USB-C. So you also have to have an additional slot for that. Um, the other ones only need a USB. That's it. Gonna lurk for a little bit. Gonna start on my paint. All right, brother. I would have to go get a splitter, yeah. And I think that's why I stopped using mine, dude, because I got tired of switching it back and forth when I wanted to game and when I wanted to stream. With the USB Sorry, one, I just plug it in when I'm ready to use record. it. You actually did perfect. I'll give you the low side, Brian. Just give me a second. Uh, you don't have a USB. Do you have a, a USB block, like one that you can plug into your computer? That gives you additional USB ports? I got one I can recommend. I've been using it for like two years now and I love it. I've got like seven or eight additional USB things plugged into it. Like I've got 13, two, three mouse. I got here. two mouses plugged in, two keyboards. Uh, it handles it pretty well. It's got a separate power source, so it doesn't drain any power from your computer. It doesn't take any power when you plug in more devices to it. So you can plug in your wheel, or I wouldn't recommend your wheel. I'd recommend your your pedals. You're doing well, Travis. We're starting from the pits. Yeah, car's quick. It was a test run. I didn't want to throw it in the middle of the field, but the test is going good so far. Well, I either don't have a setup or a talent or both. I'll, I'll, send, I'll send you a recommendation for one, dude. It's a useful tool. Like I said, I love it. I've, I've been using it for a while. Yeah, dude. Um, which is kind of cool. So I have so I many USB can. devices. The 49-inch has a USB extender like built into it. You can plug it in. Like one USB cord into another, I'll so I keep most of my I keep my shifter, my pedals and everything plugged into the 49 inch, and then everything else gets fed over to that block, and then anything that's on my computer station over there is fed to the actual PC. All right, everybody. The moment I put on the green will be when we get our cross. I'm letting it get away from me. But yeah, I've got, there's one built into the 49 and there's one on the block. I'll send you the block one that I think it's by Anchor. If you shop at Walmart, you've probably seen or heard of Anchor. It's by them. I get it. I'm trying to get away from the guy behind me. I keep staring in my mirror. I'm doing this is putting the logos in the car first. That's what you should do. You should put your logo, the number, sponsors, you should put all that stuff on the car and then paint a scheme around it. Low side uh, one, or nine I mean. I get. 
That way you don't put stuff in place like major components and have to move them later because you're like, oh fuck, doesn't look good with this. I don't know, anchor charging block. You do got one of those? Those things are awesome, aren't they? You have the one... Oh, an anchor charging block. Okay, never mind. Yeah, dude, anchor. Anchor's a good product, man. I really do. Them and... I like what was it for a while? Black Web? Black Web was another really good one for a little bit. I haven't seen Web in a while, though. Merging up off the tube. Hitting. When he's hitting. Or about that point. Do that caution to come out soon if there is going to be one. Gary knows how to do that. Gary knows how to do a lot of stuff. Gary, Gary, I once saw Gary kiss a one dollar bill with his butt cheek. And then he told that one dollar bill to have a beautiful day. No. Where's funny exiting? That's funny, I like that. You have new tires? No. Coming up on the halfway point. Jesus Christ, dude. <laughs> right? No warning at all. Got a car coming up on him. He just decides to slow down hard. Unfucking believable, dude. Come on. What happened, Travis? Uh, I was on the bottom with this guy right behind him. Um, trying to set up for a pass, and then he just stopped right in the middle of the track to a pit. Like, no warning, no nothing. Gotta love it. What uh, what program are you using, Gary? Who was it? You, you remember? Oh, uh, so you're letting, nope. you're letting the template do all the work for you. Uh, I don't remember. I'll check whenever I go to the replay. I'm killed. Um, sorry the caution came out, guys. I was just minding my own, man. It was a 14 car. Good race at 19. It was the 14. The guy in the Danica Patrick car. <laughs> Go see. Five, three, two, one. Right I got a question for you guys. If you wear your tires radio, will they blow? You will get a black flag that will tell you to come in, and you know you're at 50% whenever your crew chief will tell you, you're wearing out your right front, you're wearing out your right rear. They'll let you know when you're 50. That's it, go. Well, I don't have a very good setup, or I'm really driving it not very well, because my right front, 3% on the inside, left 39% on the outside, and that's after, well, I just, I just hit it a few minutes ago before that caution. Yeah, you're using your wheel way too much. That was 44% on the right front. I don't know if that's good or bad. I was 65-44. You know, this is where my right for the 35. I don't know about the black flag. How do I change the colors and grip? I don't know about the black flag. It does give you a black flag. So how do you keep yourself from doing what I did? 
seat time, practice. You just gotta you gotta adjust your your wheel and get used to moving the wheel a certain amount. The biggest issue that people have when they first come on is they just turn the wheel, and you you only have to use like ten percent of your wheel that you think you do. You guys keep your offset and your um, uh, what do you call it the steering ratio as like normal, or do you just adjust it? It just depends on how you how it feels for you to be honest but it depends on how fast you sit it in the corners also there's that too like if you notice you're moving sideways a little bit or you hear more scrub you got to slow down entry or slow down mid corner because you're going in too quick and you're washing up turning more doesn't help that slowing down does yeah it's mostly wheel input Yep, and if you're burning your back tires up here, a lot of it has to do with when you're coming off the corners, getting onto it way too early. Yeah, you gotta be patient. What Logan said with the steering ratio, I think that's personal preference, 100%. Dude. Um, I run 10 to 1. I know guys that run 8 to 1, 16 to 1. That's personal preference. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise. It wears tires if you turn it more than you need to. Yep, it's all about what's how you can make your wheel feel. And your force feedback, well, I, I think, have a lot Chicago to do with it, too, because it, you know, obviously muscle memory and stuff. Okay, I'll have to work on that, because uh, I, obviously what I'm doing is not working. Check out, um, it's going to sound dumb, but go to Twitch. Like, I mean, I'm streaming right now. Go check out Casey Kerwin or, like, one of the pro guys that stream all the time. You can really see how, how little you really have to put in to, to get it to do something. I'm not live right now, but if you're always welcome to watch. I'll drop you a follow after this, Travis. Appreciate that. I don't have a cool button like that. Yeah, I stream on Pornhub sometimes if you guys want to watch. Lean at the plug. I, I do appreciate the help, though, guys, because I find that the more help we all get, the better drivers we all are. For sure, it's always worth helping somebody. Cause I was there where you're at this too. So, hell, you're still there, Logan. <laughs> it takes a lot of laps to get comfortable. I'm about to smash this Bill Davis racing right in the behind. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to try and sneak in there. Wow, he almost killed me first. God, I hate starting on the outside in this place. Well, I backed off and let them get by me if I get down. Well, thanks for giving me enough room in three and four there. Quite 12. Go low here, Brian. Woo! Dude, I love to stream on Pornhub. But the best thing, man, those uh, stepson bangs and stepmom ones, let's go. I'm good. I think you meant to say gay.
stock car was actually really good. Yeah, I'm throwing a couple of local lines logos on the car. Of course you are, dude. I assume you got a 4X out of that contact, Travis. Yeah, I'm not too concerned about it. What you got to do, man, is go over and see if Lion can design you a Lion logo. I got a 0X. It just grazed me. I don't know if you know, but your uh, numbers are all messed up on your car, Travis. <laughs> me, me. There's what's up, Scoots? Up. I think my right front's looking outwards right now. I'm just saying, you get your number over your other number, so it's hard to see. Oh uh, yeah, this is um, this is my testing uh, account, so I didn't pay for the trading paint, so I just threw my regular paint on there. My testing account. You can go over here. Howdy, howdy. Today is Thursday. Thursday night football is tonight. Bengals and Ravens. Bengals and Ravens. Hey, Travis, I got your buddy behind me. <laughs> He's coming up on me, too. I'll let him be. You're a better man than me. Your man. I identify as one. Like I said, this is my test account. I'm not going to ruin someone else's race being you guys because of him. I'm just here to test. On Monday, I need the Chiefs to beat the Eagles. That's going to be a good game, dude. Fine, I'm good behind you, by the way. I'm just cruising here, making laps, trying to learn some stuff. Yeah, I'm fighting this thing. I had damage earlier. string behind us. When you guys get here, I'm just going to stay high and let every one of you slide by. That's not how you let a leader pass. I don't think you're referring to me, were you, Josh? No, 15. Can't read the button. You get out of the way for the leaders. You gotta be predictable, man. You can't just park in front of the mid-exit. Hope you all having a good day so far. I'm just waking up. 
I'm having a good one, man. I'm having a good one. Just started the stream, messing around right now. For about an hour ish. Yeah, but you got stuff you gotta do around the house. I'm expected to hop on immediately and go, man, is Yopa J on? I gotta go check out Yopa J. Most days we play Truck Simulator together. You gotta do like a whole role play thing with it too, man. You gotta be like truckers from the deep south. You guys gotta have fun with that. Like dress up for it and everything. I think it's from burning up my tires when I get back on throttle. I am, uh, man, I'm afraid to pass this guy up here. I got the color combo blue, silver, and black. You have another shade of blue? Oh. It's awesome. Like Dungeons and Dragons for truckers. You have like road bosses and shit. You gotta collect so much money to defeat the, the tax boss. I can see them making a trucker role playing game based off of that suggestion. Yopa, do you have ATS? I do have ATS. I think I played it for about an hour and I was just, I couldn't do it, dude. I couldn't do it. I, I spent most of my life driving on highways and shit, traveling from here to Texas every summer and Christmas. And that's a, that's a 17, 20 hour drive somewhere in there. That was like every summer, every Christmas, man. The, the and then when I got in the military, field. it was like 24, 27 hour drives from home to here. I'm tired of looking down the highways, man. I don't want to, I don't want to drive down a highway. I'm gonna try to drive around a racetrack. What do you think he'll know that nobody reads that?
You guys think there'll be a caution? Well, I left Jared behind me, so that's nice. I don't want all time best lap, son of a bitch. That's what I wanted right there. All right, here we go. Justin's getting away from me. I think he's doing better on this, on uh, his throttle control. I'm definitely struggling there. Stay high, uh, 15. Thank you. You have no problem. Thank you, 15. Appreciate you. Yeah, something lines that I not have. Uh, ready for the quarter panel. Yeah, do you go out and find a font that the Lions use? And then spell your name out, Gary. In the uh, the same design as the uh, the Detroit Lions fought. Oh, I'm having one saved already. Nice, dude. Oh, that's a tough fight. I'll go high and turn through this switch. Trying to get that P2, man. Oh, 
hitting the wall, I lost all this spot. I hit the wall in that first run and it gave me a 30 second damage. Then you got a zero X out of it. 38 seconds. I'll trade with you. Yeah, you're only one spot behind me, so. You're still gaining. We're both gaining. I am super loose, so. I was fighting tight off, now I'm fighting loose off. back there, Travis. Don't you try it. Oh, you're good. I'm not bothering you. I ain't even gonna try if I got there. I'm just messing with you. I just, you're catching me from so damn loose. God damn it, motherfucker. Fuck! Oh, son of a bitch, dude. Great racing up front, guys. God bless. Fucking asshole! Great win, Ethan. Hey, great race, Justin. Thank you. Good race, guys. That was a tough. That was a tough top five, dude. <laughs> oh my goodness, dude. That was a good race. That was a good race. In all fairness, I waited for a T4. I mean, no, I... The timing was perfect. The timing was fucking perfect, dude, but holy shit. I gotta, I gotta start clipping that shit, dude. I'm gonna start... I'm gonna make a fucking montage. It's just gonna be me getting scared the shit out of by everybody that stops by this fucking channel. Show me the Yoba Jays channel yet? No, no, yeah, yeah. What could you do there? You can scare the shit out of him. Just catch it when he's like zoned down ADD mode. <laughs> it's easy. He does it every five minutes. He just zones the fuck out. Fuck. I know I wasn't talking at all. I was reading. I looked at it, read a little bit, and then go back to race and read. Because I was so focused on just trying to catch his ass. Uh, we almost had it. Where are we at? I wanted to look at my laps.
23.8 was my fastest. I'd say I'd, I'd stayed pretty consistent. I definitely picked something up that run. Damn, man. I'm sorry, guys. I wonder if you could see my reaction in the fucking wheel. It was like right there, wasn't it? God, man. Let off on the gas and the wheel shakes. I don't know if I'm doing that because I'm afraid of hitting the wall. Bro, I was on a meeting and that even scared me. <laughs> Go. But uh, yeah, no, dude, I totally get you on that one. It's kind of like anime kids, dude. It, it's You can tell what what anime people started with right like you could tell a lot of people who like who don't like dragon ball didn't start watching anime till oh god man Get ready. Going green. i trying to think of a, another popular one where the graphics started to change and stuff because right, the 80s animes looping the third and shit man very different very different from what one piece and shit is I'm horrible at restarts, I'm sorry! I didn't try to go three wide there. That would have been dumb. That sucked. That sucked. I'm so sorry, it's my fault. You pinched me about five laps earlier too. Oh, that was exciting. Ever not want to do anything? Absolutely. See, he knows what I'm talking about. Chores. Ever just want to wake up and be like, you know what? I just want to sit here for a few minutes and enjoy friends. A better time, a better time. I'd heard if you didn't dive bomb me like that or whatever. Love this track, dude. You can run so many different grooves. Just wears the tires out in certain grooves. 
God, it just sucks. I had to give up all those fucking spots, man. I'm impressed as hell that he saved it, dude. It was like a fucking magic trick. I'm trying to get a run. Let's see if I can do it here on this exit. I got knocked down from a 4.0 down to a seat. Damn, bro. I believe it, dude. Unfortunately, those things don't matter. Like, your safety rating does not matter at all. It's, it's easy to get back, especially when we have like 110 lap races or 120 when we go to Richmond or Nashville. Man, I can't believe that didn't bring out a caution, though. That's, I guess that was kind of sucks right now. bad for Cole here, but I'm going to have to get around him here in a minute. Washing up mid-corner so I can do this, but I don't think it's worth it. Eighty-sevens absolutely killed my IR. Just crushed it. I won't touch those damn cars, dude. That shit's nuts. But too many of them people are just running each other over just for fun. Matthew Cole here is driving up my ass right now. Not really sure where he came from. I'll let him go, dude. I don't know what it is. I don't feel comfortable around him. Too soon, Josh. Holy shit, <clears throat> I messed my tires up. You had it. Tires are good, about 40 to 50 laps. Or don't burn yourself yeah, up dude, so the guys who don't restart. You know what I mean? The guys who don't restart right off the bat. They've gone in, get replaced 30 lap old tires. Everyone else is going to replace 30 lap tires. They're over there doing whatever the fuck they want to do. I think I, the most I've done on Xfinity series this week is I want to say 70 70 or 80 laps I think we've been on like 13 or, or 30 or something you make it to the end and I had 0% left on my tread on my right rear I was overdriving so fucking much
You stop it there's the answer. No call. I haven't ran open in the trucks yet. I need to. I, I just haven't done it yet. I noticed, so you make it to the back, dude. You're getting washed to the back pretty quick. I'm definitely picking up on some stuff. This is the first truck race I've done so far. Like I came, I didn't know what to expect coming in here. Definitely picking up on a little bit more with the track. I, I want to see my tires. I can get more understanding of what I'm doing wrong. And all that once I see the tires. Six car here has got to have no tread left. The six car was one who was sideways and smoked everywhere. Hey man, or stupid are you? I let you pass, you just bumped me. Fuck off, man. I'm, I'm there. I love the fact he's mad he got dumped, but he dumped the guy like five last minutes. Yeah, I'm gonna check memory on that one. Thanks, Felix. Like
Go inside. <clears throat> Wasted so much damn time behind him, dude. Good racing is just wasted so much time trying to get around him. Three seconds to the next guy. Had to give a guy the chrome horn on a couple times yesterday. I mean, I I felt like I was being pretty fair, right? Like, I nudged him on the straights. I think trying to get him to speed up, but I don't think there was a moment where I was the being or where I was being the aggressor. I think I was just trying to fucking be get around his ass. I felt like he was being super aggressive. It's still a good fight. Like, it was still fun, but watching him through the field and stuff, he's just throwing, like, the blocks. I guess the blocks is what bugged me. I'm not a big fan of blocking. I'm not a big fan of blocking at all. There's, there's, there's defensive driving blocking, and then there's blocking. Like, if I'm driving down the straight and the guy's about to go low and I do this, that's just defensive driving, right? But if... We're driving down the straight, and the guy does this. Like, what are you doing, dude? You're killing it for both of us. Like, I'm gonna react to your car acting like a fucking buffoon. Like, I don't trust you to keep it. Then the guy shoved me up the track after I passed. Yeah, dude. They're fucking. They're, they're aggro here. They're super aggro. I mean, I get it, you know, I think. Yeah, a lot of these guys, this is all they do. They sit here and drive this all day long. And then they see the, the horrible racing they put on, dude, and they're like, oh, this is how you race the trucks. That was another guy that slowed me down earlier. That was another guy that threw a hard block. All I'm trying to do at this point is just increase the distance to that guy. Ah, uh, 1.1. 1. 1. Here it Easy on that right front. Good run, everybody. Good win, number two. Good race, everyone. Like ha 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 ha! I got you, kinda. <laughs> oh man, dude! What a weird race, right? I mean, that was I was still hard racing. Like it was, it was good racing for a while. I just, God, look, look at that! We're all over the track with this guy. It backed out, yeah.
I mean, really, like, if you come down to it, it's just good, hard racing. Like, he's giving me some. I'm giving him some. I think that might have upset him, maybe. I don't know. Like I said, I was there. Like, I was already on the outside, but... That's hard, dude. Look at that. I did not like that. Well, your setups are blindingly fast here. I just haven't had enough luck to win a race yet. Well, 10 4, man. Good luck. Good luck. Man, that was a great ice cream cone. I'm uh, kind of handicapped starting in the back, but we'll see. Get ready. Going green. I'm lurking, sitting at the bar about to eat. Hell yeah, Strong man. Get the food in. Mm. Wait, what bar? What kind of food? What are we eating here? It's fucking 2 o'clock on a Thursday. I sense a crash coming out of turn two. Don't come down. Don't come down. You know you'll stay there if you don't come down. You're not there, dog. You're not there. Carlo, 19, Carlo. Check up back to the two. Yeah. Well, that was scary. Glad I made it through. I'm sorry, I should have been low when I'm letting you guys buy, shouldn't I? First lap. Not even the first lap. Super fun time. Five and a half minutes. Certainly pays to, uh, to qualify at this track. Especially one. I have a look at it. Ten minutes are optional. Well, I avoided the first one and then got caught up in the second one. We were almost out of it too. I gotta check my power. Or just be slow enough that you're already half a lap down on entry to one. However, that happens. <laughs> and then I pull into the pits. Right there. And I uncheck my tires because I say back caution free. I don't want to waste the set. And it changes the right side. <laughs> Did you uncheck them when you were already in the middle of getting one changed? Negative. I think what it did was I had wheel damage and it changed it because of that. Something like that. Uh, it won't change unless it's checked. You probably unclicked it too late. Yep, that's what I was thinking. Yeah, because that's happened to me several times. 
I respect how you handle things. Can't do that. As long Can't as you do move what, what? even if you're in your box. I mean, the other <laughs> side didn't do it. I just uh, I just blanked out to a happy and place for a little bit. Yet. Wait, what's Maybe, happening? I don't know. If <laughs> you're in your box, I guess you're committed. Even if you check it, uh, you can't you go stop. from top to bottom. Well, it's not just that. Like, so let's go back, right? And this is this is my perspective. And if anybody wants to tell no, me I'm wrong, let me let me know. But this is until I get up. The this is what I've gate. gathered already, just from kind of looking at how this kind of develops. I'm trying to find a really good camera view. Okay, so chopper. There's 19. And it set my car down. Then. There's the 19 car right here, right? And then I'm right here. Again, if I'm wrong, let me know. All right. So we got 19 up here who's already losing definite pace up ahead in the corner. You can see it with the 22 car blown by him on the bottom. Before we come out of this turn, we are going to be midway at his door. Green flag, green flag. And then losing it because he gets a higher run on the outside. But just based off of that, he's already falling back. So I'm not expecting him to come down. I'm expecting him to just kind of maintain his, his line on entry for a second curve, I guess. So I'm trying to do a, a lower entry going into one because I was already past his panel for most of the turn. He makes it past my car at the very end of the front stretch and then comes down. All right, let's rewatch it. So mid corner ish, we're already kind of at the panel. We're mid door at the exit. He's got the run. We're starting to lose it, which I'm okay with. Like, I'm fully aware, but we know he's slower in the corner. I mean, oh, that's a good angle right there. Shit. Let me just take my gloves off. It's not like we're going back out there. I doubt my engine's going to be good enough to go back out there. Ugh. I know I was going to lose something here real soon, so. Yeah. So my situation again, panel, mid. We're going to lose him on the front stretch because he's on throttle a little bit longer than we are. And then as we come down, he just comes down, right? Yeah. Well, I'm wondering. Yeah, he does come over pretty hard. Yeah, sucked. I'm bottoming out right there. Gotta love that paint scheme. And then I'm losing it. Too heavy on the brakes. I'm trying to get used to my, my pedal changes, man. I'm not like the others. And I guess whenever I whipped around too, and I knew I was losing it, I was trying to get the idea to stop the back end from hitting the wall. So I'm trying not to slide up that way. I just want the car to settle somewhere over here in the red zone, basically. I want it to safely drift up kind of toward the wall so the whole bottom half of the track is open. And as we're doing it, it just doesn't work out that way. So in this situation with Mike, I guess this is what I would have done different. This time. Again, this is just my opinion on survival here. So Mike is the one who technically ends our race because he runs into us after after contact. Um, right here, he makes a decision. And his decision right now is I'm going to think that Josh is staying down in the bottom. So I'm going to whip it up to the top. I'd be worried about whipping up to the top here because when you've got to, what you got to do right after that is you got to come right back down. Now you're sending all that speed up to the wall and then you're asking to come right back down. So I guess I'm, I would be worried about that because that's why we're sliding up is because the speed we're going, you know, it's going to keep pushing us up the track. We didn't get hit down where we got hit while going into the corner. So we're going to slide up. Um, 
Mike makes a decision. I, I'm going to go here. Second guesses himself here. But like, see how he's coming up the track? You watch all the way through. Need to pause. Momo to delay. What do I do? I think Mike. Mike is the only one who touched me. I don't think anyone else hit me. Oh, no. 15 did, but it was love. It was love tap. Yeah. So we lose it going up the track, knowing I'm going to go up the track. There's nothing I can prevent myself from going up the track. It's just how far am I going to go to hit that wall? The whole bottom of the track. Like, you got you to think in this situation, you got to escape down to the bottom, right? You can't. You got to escape to the bottom. That's the only way out. He's stuck at the wall. He's, he's going to stick to the wall and he's going to lock his brakes up there. Oh. But I'm pretty sure he stays right there. He doesn't go anywhere. I slide up to the wall. I don't know who 19 is. I haven't even looked at the name of that other driver. Not even once. But yeah. Control Z. If you guys want to know how to do that, where I can use the mouse to move the camera, it's Control Z. Control Z. Control Zebra. Yeah. Um, you can use your mouse wheel to scroll up and down, left click, or left click, right click. Just to guide in and out. If you're making some pretty cool video shots or something, you could probably get like a... Combine that with the keyboard movements. Cha-cha. Practice. Da-da-da-da-da. Oh, you're acting like a three-year-old. Um, yeah, no, you slide up. Mike gets run into us, which doesn't help him at all, but that's part of his delay. This guy, this guy would probably kill us anyways, actually. This guy was, we were, if Mike doesn't touch us here in a, in, a, in a perfect world, if Mike stays low, this guy fucking, he hits our front end, we're going to hit that fucking wall. This dude came in like a fucking wrecking ball. Holy shit. Ted. Holy shit, your name should kill or something god damn what your cockpit say what does your cock say oh bro that would make a cool emo right it's like a chicken it's like words coming out it's like, what does your cock say slowing down he's aware of it he doesn't see me at fucking all though there it is This guy's only sin, this guy's only problem is just being too high. <laughs> yeah. Man, dude, those are the worst ones. Those are the worst fucking ones. Smart. I'm smart PM's uh I'm gonna come back out here, I'm gonna be the big dick of the boss. Big dick of the creek. 17 seconds. Put gloves on. Going back out there with a brand new car. They're coming back in the garage. We also have exceeding the speed in the pits and shit. So we're going to sit for a little bit. And I forgot to charge my fucking headphones because they just beeped at me. Speeding in the pits. You're going to make me fucking roll out and roll right back in and serve this fucking pedal day, aren't you? Oh, 
hold for 15 seconds now. That's cool. I'm gonna go out there and wreck the guy that wrecked me. That's all I want to do. I'm gonna go out there and systematically take people out until it's close enough to where the 19 is near somebody and they're done. It'll be like, that was my master plan the whole time. Don't y'all jump over that wall with them fucking tires. I said no tires. That's right, you stay on the fucking wall. I'll still have some minor damage, dude. Did they fix my whole car? Come on. Oh, is that the 19? That is the 19. He's still in the pits. Oh, don't speed! We just got done fucking speeding. Don't speed. Too. I can make it a lot less for you. Catch me if you want. Just don't bounce off the wall. Go to the middle and then try going back to the wall. And we should be good. Twenty-one. Come on, buddy. You, I I sure hope you got a little more skill than that. I'm not trying to be mean, but you almost ran me down to the inside wall on the back stretch. You got to have some control. It's a great view for your customer right there. We both got it too. Uh, good old macaroni salad, have a day, da da da. Macaroni salad likes to play, da da da. Forgot to hit the play, I hit the play on the music. Let me know if you hear that music today. I'm damn near 25 laps down. I'm gonna run you over. Good old Mike Cook. Yeah, I thought both of you guys get into him. I thought by the third car he'd have it figured out, but. I just don't have the time to write out what I think. Well, that we fit. Well, that's because you were raised right. Mommy and Daddy said if it takes more than you know a couple words, shut your fucking mouth. Thirty-four. And it comes back and forth, knockout punch. Thank you. Wait. A good one. Oh. see a dollar from me I don't have anything against it dude I really don't I get along with him good I know a lot of people don't like his ass though oh scratchy scratch scratchy See a dollar out of me. God, I forgot what song that is.
No shit, I can feel it. 50 cent? That's what it is, P-I-M-P. -P. Never get a dollar out of me. I heard that song forever. Good song. I'm sorry, Brandon, I had a lap car sticking it three wide on the outside. One with a microphone who still hasn't owned up. Uh, it's all good, Jeff, man. That's just a bummer, man. I didn't know you were three wide. Unreal. Yeah, when I made the move, it was only because Jeff got loose in the corner, so I went around the outside. I thought I would just have one exit. I was not expecting to be three wide, so three wide is not my intent. Yeah, but he got loose like a few laps before that happened, I believe. No, it was right in front of me. Just Well, he didn't get like super loose, but he got loose enough to where I thought I could just make a run around the outside, so I did. He washed up, but that's all it was. Bad choice on my part, bad decision. I'm sorry for that. I'm streaming. I can show you my point of view later if you want, Brandon. Yeah, dude. I, the thing that just upset me about it was you're a lap car. I'm sorry the race isn't going your way, but sticking it to the top there is completely unnecessary. Yeah, you're right. You, you as a driver know better than to, than to do something like that. That's why I was upset, but it is what it is. Yeah, no, I agree, man. It was a bad choice on my part. Like I said, I made that decision just off of, I saw your back end kind of kick out a little bit. I saw you wash up. So I was like, okay, I can just stick to the outside. I had no intention of putting it three wide. I didn't think Brandon was going to make his move to the inside at the same time. Brandon was already to my inside. That's why I was up in the middle and why he got loose. Not when I made my move. I'm sorry, it wasn't. I was in the middle of passing both of you in that turn going into it. It's just that it's a 20 lap new retires, Jeff. I'm, I'm sorry. It's just like, yeah. Yeah, I was in the middle because I was giving Brandon space, but I, I don't know. I there certainly was a car to the inside, but it's whatever. Yeah, so when your back end popped out, I just thought you were going to stay low. Like that's all I thought. I went around the top. I was like, all right, he's going to get under control. He needs to slow down anyway. So that's why I made my move. I mean, even like now, I put seven or eight seconds on him, right? Like, he's way back there. Wait, so do you guys want me staying high when you catch me, or what? 
Yeah, whatever, whatever you feel comfortable with, I'll get around either way. Just hold it. You know better. That's amazing. I don't feel comfortable on track, man. I had already committed to going to the high side because I was a faster car. Like I work. already was. I just did not think that Brandon was going to make his move at the same time. Like Brandon wasn't there when I started making a run to the outside. The only reason why I'm even pushing as hard as I did is because he gets loose, and we can go back and look at it. But... Can fit in this lap. Can it fit? It sucks for Brandon because Jeff got loose. I'm hugging the wall, but yeah, I 100% made a bad move. It definitely was. So I got on up to that. I could have waited to the exit. Appreciate it. No, it was just me losing control, not able to take my line. I think putting people down publicly isn't the way to go about things, and that's where I lost respect. I mean, when he was like, oh, he's got a microphone, he wanted to call me out. Yeah, I'll own up, dude, but all I can tell you is my perspective. Like, that's it. I can't tell you what all was happening. All I can tell you is my perspective, and you're going to tell me different because you're telling me your perspective. And, like, no matter what, it's just perspective versus perspective, and we can't actually talk about what happened until the race is fucking over. So like, what do you want me to do, bitch about what my perspective was versus your perspective? Thank you. Yeah, no, I had, and I'll own up to it, and I did. Like, I'm not yelling, I'm not freaking out or anything about it. Like, it's a bad choice. It was. Like, I'm going to the widest portion of the track with a fresh set of tires to get around people with 20 lap older tires. Like, I, I'm going around people where I can go around people. I'm trying to race. Or not race, guy. I mean, that's selfish to say. Like he said, you're not trying to race. It's just 20 lap newer tires, man. Like, I just have more grip. Like, I have to slow down so fucking much. You didn't go after him publicly. It's just that the guy made a wrong choice that got you wrecked. <laughs> yeah, but at, there's like three choices were made at that time, you know? Jeff made whatever choice he did when he went in the corner. Like I said, his back end slid out. So I was like, okay, all right, he's getting loose. I went around. Hey, Jonathan, I got Logan behind me. You want me to wreck him? <laughs> nah, don't do that. At this point, I gotta save a little bit just to try and make it to the end, <laughs> and hopefully gain maybe a couple spots back. Maybe. I heard that. But, but yeah, no, I totally get why he's upset. I mean, I passed him. I just passed him again. He's gonna come out with a fresh set of tires, but. If I had older tires, I'm definitely not making that move. I'm not going around a guy who's getting loose on older tires. Like, I'm not going to do that. Like, I've got newer tires. It's, it's the only reason I made my decision. But I don't know, man. I guess I, it kind of irks me a little bit, too. The whole, he's got a mic and he hasn't owned up. I haven't owned up because I don't know what happened. I got no X. I got nothing. I made no contact. Like, I don't know what happened. You're faster than me, nine. Take the low line. But then wait and have a respectable discussion after. Yeah, and I will. I mean, that's just how some people are, though. Right? Like, some people, for whatever reason, they have to be the center of attention, which I think is where we're at with this whole... the other stuff that's going on, you know what I mean? Like, I think that's where that all comes from. Well, I always mute my mic. I just, uh, I talk too fucking much, dude. I do. I talk too fucking much, if I'm being honest. I know I do. Like, I run my mouth a lot. I say dumb shit all the fucking time. Like, I know I do. 
Like, I don't need a rocket scientist to, to tell me otherwise. Ran to you during Phoenix race, during race, Phoenix race. Hell yeah, dude. I don't think I had a good week that week, if I remember right. I think I had a couple good races, but a lot of it was uh, was really bad. A lot of it was really, really bad. Almost one caution, but fucked up. Fucked up that race. I've done that a couple times. Because I'd rather have a fair race to the finish than a guaranteed finish. Like, I don't know. I'll hold, I'll pinch a guy down. Like I'll I'll hold down no, no. and and give you know a hard side by side. But I won't just block it because I I want that side by side finish. You know, I want that. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I'm I'm in more in for the side by side than I am for the win itself. I'd rather do that. Ah, uh, but I'm not, you haven't had a chance to repair that, that sucks. Oh, it's repaired. 20 laps down. I see you coming, Scott. Yeah, I'll go high. How long can I go on this one set of tires? <laughs> well, I've been on mine 55. I'm already this far though. Haven't swapped yet. <clears throat> Did I just finish it? Have you heard them say take it easy on your front right? Sorry, I didn't mean to chop. Didn't mean to chop you there, bud. No, they haven't. I'll let you go. When you get the cue, take it easy on your front or your, your rear. It's set your tires are about 50%. Yeah, I'm on If they hit zero, you'll get a, black, a meatball that tells you you got to come in and change it. You don't want to stay out too long either, or else you're just losing a lot of time. Yeah, but now it's a challenge. Yeah, if you haven't taken yet your bet's made, you sort of gotta ride it out. Do you have fuel? I'm still going, so I guess. You don't have an overlay, do you? No. Also, I turned crew chief off. Uh, I think it's F2 in your black box should bring up your fuel management window. You probably got about eight last box. Yeah, it's F4. What's up, gamer? How we doing, man? Everybody got those fresh shoes on. This one's a wash, man. We went we went down twenty something laps. Got most of got all of it repaired. Played words, words with friends for a little bit. Oh, there goes my lap We're just chill anyway. I don't care anymore. Is he talking about lap lead? Oh, he got a point for lap lead. I'm still 23 down. Mike's got two laps on me. He's already gone in for fresh tires. Did 
the guys behind me have fresh tires. Run it dry anyways, I guess. Dragon. Thank you. Ah, oh, dude, my race is already over. I don't really have a have a say in it. I'm not getting any positions here. The uh, being 23 laps down helps. I just want to run the laps. Trying to leave it open. You should have no problem getting by. Wasting my tires, you motherfucker. Like, I don't even know what lap everybody's on. Doing good, messed up. I hit the wall. Oh, Thank you, shit. Jerry. Oh, we're talking about racing. You can run a dry, although I'll be, I'll be here. Oh, oh, bro. Ew, dude. You gotta put some lube on it then. You talk about some dry shit. Fuck. Go to a doctor. When I put on Take her to the doctor. Right, 35, rear right, 45. Even beat up, shit should still look like fucking cold turkey. There's be some fucking wetness to it. Jesus. That's, that's actually pretty impressive. It's out there looking like the fucking Sahara. I'm slow, so. Goddamn Kentucky Fried Chicken Leg right there, dude. Right. Jesus. Yeah, it was 60 30. Da ba da da. I thought Ted would have caught me by now, man. Holy fuck, dude. It's all yours on the inside here, Ted. I'm gonna take it high. Have fun with that, Logan. Almost got my lap back by doing that. Really? That's what you should do. Oh, uh oh. Sorry, four I didn't see it for the last second. I didn't see that car moving at 185 miles an hour. I'm sorry about that. That's my best, best, best stuff. Puchkowski and pressure right there. Oh, I'm so tight. Silver's 25% driving the car, 25% dodging lap cars, 25% not speeding on pit road, and 25%... Oh, no, we're laps down, dude. We, we died lap one. Lap fucking one, Eli. We, we got fucked on lap one. Yeah, the track takes it out of you. I'm just trying back here, Chaps. I'm not going to do anything. Yeah, dude, uh... Sorry. I don't know why I'm even driving so hard. I still need half a gallon to finish this. But, uh, yeah, some guy... Losing... He was losing a lot of time at a 1 and 2. I was mid-car. What's up, baby? Okay. Okay. All right.
We blew our rear. really is the car i run a lot so it's just a learning experience guys so good. So good to less you gotta take care of your tires in xfinity you have to take care of your tires i did not take care of my tires my tires are about to look like a thing from a fucking horror picture movie or something uh fuck you and your penalty bro yeah 52 27 what what are they saying i blew my right rear then oh my left front apparently i blew Apparently, I have a hole in the outside of my left front. What the fuck? No, I, no, I see the meat flags already, or the meat meatballs already gone. I changed the tires and it was done. Oh, I didn't win. I had no one. No one. I had no one. Take notes, I go, you go number five. Yourself. I was number five. Done. Get going. Did you right rear Tuesday? That was fun. I think I did actually. I think I was down to like 13 or 14 percent when I pit. That was a fun race. I love this track, dude. I'm just not very good at it. If this is Darlington, man, let's go to Darlington, baby. Oh, I blew, dude. I blew my fucking. Uh, I had a zero percent my right rear on the first race of the week that I did. Logan, I'm gonna let you go. I'm gonna just stay. My mouse just fell off. Like, should I be a dick? Let's make this fun with a caution. What the lap cars make it fun? I gave you plenty of room. But did you have fun? Yeah, I good. did. I had lots of fun. Yeah. Yeah, there's been a couple. Hello. I'm losing 118 IR. Holy shit, pitting, dog. Pitting, pitting, pitting. Danga, danga do. So my tires are just starting to drop off. <laughs> if I slow you down, I'll let you buy right away. Yeah, right. My bad, hit the wall, taking others, but bad, but messing the steering. Yeah, once you start impacting that steering, it definitely feels like a different car. Nope. This is such a fun car to drive, though. I'd rather drive this car than anything else. I get better driving the trucks though. You gotta get better driving all the cars. The trucks. I just don't drive the trucks enough, man. I used to. Like when I first got into racing, I really liked the trucks. Appreciate you, Mike. Your audio is messing up. Yeah, dude. It's. I gotta, I gotta figure out how to fix it. I don't know why it's doing that. 
still doing that one coming out of pits and randomly. I was listening to uh, Luna's this uh, Luna's stream the other day. And I noticed it was doing it to him too. So I got to figure out how to adjust that. Yeah, it'll it'll stop in just a second. It does that for whatever reason. It does it for a couple laps after a pit. I haven't really figured out why. Yeah, dude, I don't know what it is. I need to link up with Panic to see if he can help me figure out what it is. Appreciate it, Brandon. Jason, if you get up to my bumper, I'll let you by. Uh, so the checks have to be aggressive to be fast because the power is a lot less in these cars. Yeah, dude, I noticed that you have to be very aggressive. Like, once you start losing momentum for being nice, you're, you're just kind of stepped on. You're just kind of taken advantage of. Coming like a wrecking ball. I'll say hi here for it. I got guys breathing down my neck here. I'm not for position. If you can get by him, man, go ahead. I'm not, I'm not getting spots, but if you guys are able to get position past him. Thanks, Cap. No problem. No problem. There's too many bunched up cars for me to try and pass through that are racing together here. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, too. Yep. That clean air must feel good up there. Yeah, onesies and twosies is one thing, but there's like six of you guys right here. I can't do that to you guys. I ain't no way I can win this now, so. Not dodging lap cars is fun. I think my chances went down the drain when I burnt the right rear off and then spun it going into pit road. You see how many people are hitting that inside wall going in there? No, I didn't hit the wall. I just uh, got loose. Oh, or were you saying that you hit the wall? No, I was saying in general, uh, most of the races I've done this week, there's been somebody that's like completely burned through. They hit that inside wall and they like bounce to the other side. It's great. No, I just went in. I felt it getting loose and I just locked it down and self spun because I knew it wouldn't bring out a caution if I was at pit road entry. But that throws away, you know, 10 seconds while you get it back going again. Yeah, I've just seen a lot of people do that and then also hit those water barrels, dude. That's what I'm scared of every time I go in there is hitting those water barrels. This has got to be one of the crappier pit road entrances anyway. One. Oh, John. Good win, John. I peeled off for the pits on the wrong straightaway, and then I almost spun out going into the other pits. It's a miracle I'm 11th one lap down. Goodbye. Goodbye, 109 IR. Good race, guys. That was a fun run there. But definitely some interesting lap cars. 
Yeah, Jeff, I'm sorry about earlier. You're just fresh tires. I was moving around everybody and stuff. I just didn't even think about it. I just went to the high side. No, you're you're all good, man. The only reason I said anything and got annoyed was because I know you and like I, like I knew, I know you you knew better than that. So, but I, I was just frustrated in the moment. We're all good. Yeah, I was trying to bite my tongue because I was already mad from the first slap wreck, dude. When the guy came down across me, so I was I was just trying like I don't want to blow up. I don't want to be a dick because it was dumb. It was dumb. I kept telling myself that. No, you're all good, man. It's all good. Oh. I hope nobody had issues with me. I tried to give everybody space in that. Oh. Come in through. What the fuck is my mouth? Fox! Yeah, I have an issue. Five seconds up on me, I couldn't close that gap at the end. Use my mouse. This is my fake mouse. Mouse pad, I mean. Come here. No, don't turn sideways! The hole! From the window! To the wall! My mouse gave up at all. Man, you don't left the hole either. Yeah, no, dude, that's what's crazy is like you don't you don't leave space there at all. It is very rough to look at. Alright, so point of view. It's how I already sent it. Let me rewind it even further, actually. There we go. How our race ended. That was weird. Okay. All right, so where are we at? Yeah, nineteen car on the outside. I don't. I don't understand. Anthony Speechy. Nineteen smoke to fifteen after. Yeah, he did. Man, that looks from that view, dude. It looks like I just fucking. God, his angle makes me look guilty. But what is? He? Oh no, dude, he gets hit again. It's that wall. Damn, dude. The hell was that about? You might have stuff for me there, dude. I like I like Old Atlanta, dude. Old Atlanta was one of my my favorites. That's a track I missed from a while back. There was right, let me see.
Okay, getting right there. Yeah, this is where I thought he was getting loose, right there. So I thought he was loose right here, man. I thought he was getting loose. But I believe when we entered this corner, man, I was already committed to run outside. Yeah, when he was saying I was giving him space. What did this look like from outside? And I'm not even the one in fucking... I don't have a problem with Jeff. I don't. But this happened because Brandon came into Jeff. Jeff could have came up a little bit more, but really this happens because Brandon comes up into Jeff. I mean, even with McConey being in the middle here. But he doesn't know I'm out here, so I guess he's also expecting McConey to go up, but... Yeah, no, it was definitely a dumb move, but I mean, just look at the distance right there that we cover. The corner, like when we go into the corner here, we cover here. You have to slow down. So we're just really holding on to our momentum. This is where Jeff, you know, he calls me out. So now, you just fast forward. Oh, Jeff missed the pits. But yeah, just those guys back there, we're just, we're leaving them all back there because we got the fresher tires at the moment. And then they all go in and start to pit. Look at it from this angle. Man, that whole situation just sucks dude, front to back. It really does. He missed the corner, but it seems like you didn't realize y'all were three wide. I didn't know we were three wide because when I start making my pass, dude, Brandon's he's still down here. I see him get slid up here. I didn't realize Brandon closed that much, dude. I had no idea Brandon had closed that much. I should have let off. Man, dude, this is where... I should I should have thought of, I was just thinking about dude just running my tires. I was like, oh, I got faster tires. That's all I'm thinking about in this situation. So I'm thinking I could just outrun it. I'm thinking Brandon, dude, is still like right back here. Like I'm thinking Brandon's, fuck, man. I should have thought Brandon would try to take advantage of that situation too. Like Brandon's gonna try and make that move. Should have let off. Here. Anyways, like the more I think about it, the more I I should have just I should have planned my exit to run up to line up on his bumper and then just try to get into him in the next corner. That's what I should have done. Line up and then he would be sliding up to here. He'd be here. Like that's what I should have done. But I mean it was got weird from here. The end of the corner. It's crazy. 
All right, I have got to end my stream for a moment, guys, because I need to go pick up my daughter. I will be back so we can stream a little bit longer. Thursday Night Football tonight, I plan on watching that. Um, We ran with Rainbow earlier, so we're going to drop the love to him. I'm going to send you guys over to Rainbow's way. I appreciate everybody hanging out. Appreciate the loud bang panic and scaring the crap. I've got to figure out something you guys spend your damn points on. You're not know, trying to scare the hell out of me so often. But, uh... Keep an eye out for a cock, cock camera or something. I don't know. We'll figure something out. I want to make an emote that looks like a cockpit view or cock, cock camera. I don't know. We'll figure it out. It's a cock holding a camera. It's going to be a rooster holding a camera. It's cockpit view. Cockpit view. There we go. We'll make a rooster holding a camera. It's called cockpit. 